Can someone tell me in English uh, more about this project? Yes, so what we are doing here is uh, we are taking a part of the global uh, movement Women Smart, which is an annual event um, that is uh, uh, occurring at the anniversary of the inauguration of Donald Trump as president. Okay. And uh, this, uh, what it started as a protest against Donald Trump is now a global network of uh, thousands of organizations that are across the globe. And every year we organize an event to honor all the women uh, who have been victims of uh, sexism and uh, also all the people that are victims of uh, racism and um, uh, ableism and uh, poverty in the world. So what we are doing now is standing in solidarity with this uh, global event uh, that is occurring today uh, in all the whole world. The world. Yes. Okay. And um, yeah, so what we do is we are standing in um, solidarity with women and we're trying to uh, promote different empowering messages and also different messages that are uh, bringing light on uh, important issues such as racism, homophobia, sexism, etc. Et in Bulgaria, what kind of... Uh, uh these problems, uh, do women have uh, smaller rights in Bulgaria than the rest of uh, Europa or, or is it mainly uh, other issues? I think the problems are very similar across the globe. We do have, uh, women here have more rights in some aspects and less rights in others, but I don't think that rel uh, relativism is going to... to um, put the light on what's really at stake. I think the most important things are the pervasiveness of violence uh, on women and gender-based violence across society. I think this is relevant for Bulgaria as well as for the whole globe. I see that we uh, that women here lack access to proper reproductive rights and pro uh, proper um, um, uh, abilities uh, to access uh, public service, uh, including healthcare that in Bulgaria is uh, mostly paid uh, and covered by the patient. Uh, I see uh, the pervasiveness of racism that especially uh, is um, uh, is especially uh, strong uh, has especially strong implications on, on migrant women, on Muslim women, and on um, on Roma women here in uh -huh. Bulgaria, as well as other women of color, including also students, for example, from different countries who come here and then are being attacked for the color of their skin. So it's mainly uh, a foreign woman here that has these problems, or or are they also, or is it also for the Bulgarian woman? Uh, there are different problems that that, that uh, impact different women, different uh, groups of women, and uh, we have what we have seen is also increasing violence on L, uh, LBT women, which is uh, lesbians, bisexuals, and trans women. Uh, we have seen in increasing. Uh, economic exploitation and worsening of working conditions for Bulgarian women across the, the country, uh, especially in professions that are feminized. This is professions that are where mainly women work, such as uh, the sewing industry and uh, the uh, medical professionals. Do you think that Europa is helping these problems, or is it making them worse? Maybe could 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 it, could it be that Europa is making them worse, or are they helping in these problems? I'm not sure what you mean by Europe, but the, Euro the European Union, I mean as a whole, is it is it making things better, or is it making things uh, worse? I think what is very important is to realize that as a society and as a global community that we have a real uh, problem uh, that is uh, called gender inequality. And we have real problems that are connected to racism and homophobia and poverty across the world. And the solution to that is not uh, to wait for some government to, or organization to solve it, but the solution is mass mobilization that is going to cut uh, borders and that is going to uh, force the governments and the European Union to take drastic measures. I do not think that the European Union is, uh, making, is doing enough uh, to no. tackle gender equality. Um, it has um, uh, it has implemented some um, uh, some uh, legislation, for example, that is very useful, such as the ban on uh, working place discrimination. But this is by far not enough. For example, it does not uh, protect trans women. No. Um, and uh, I think it's uh, what is really important is to talk more um, about uh, these different types of organizations. It's how we organize on those who are in power and who have. Uh, the capacity to take decisions. That's great.
I think you're doing a great uh, job here. Thank you. So it's not so big a demonstration, but um, I think it's a good course. It's uh, a lot of courses uh, connected in one, so uh, 